Welcome to another Weebisode. I'm your host, Sarah. Let me just... Okay, hold on. Just give me a second here. So what was today's topic? All right. Yes, wire management. We've discussed the importance of wire management in previous episodes, but let's have a quick recap. PV modules can produce dangerous levels of current and voltage. 60 volts and greater is a shocking hazard. 30 to 50 milliamps can stop a heart. Proper wire management is essential to avoiding ground faults, especially at the array where conductors are installed in free air and more easily damaged by exposure to direct sunlight, animals, or sharp edges. Within the PV array, these various conductors are often secured to modules, frames, support rails, and other racking system components. While securing array wiring seems like it should be a straightforward exercise, the reality is the integrators continue to face numerous challenges. It's important to have a clear, sensible wire management plan heading into the installation. That's what I'm here to help you with. Today we will be talking about the various means in which to use Wiley's wire management line of products. From module and rail clips to bundle straps, all products are designed to make your installation easy and array safe for years to come. Our wire management solutions can fit just about any installation. They can accommodate for a broad range of cable combinations and sizes. They require no special tooling to install, support rolled edges to prevent damage to cable installation, and are listed to UL1565 and UL62275. With the ever-changing landscape of the wrecking module industry, it's difficult to have a tried and true single approach. Luckily for you, Burndy and Wiley have the answer in our breadth of products. Let's start with installing the ACC FPV. The ACC FPV gets installed onto the module frame. <clears throat> it's a straight on clip, so it's only one direction, up straight onto the module. It can accommodate two PV wires up to a diameter of eight millimeters. Next, let's talk about the ACC F90-1. This is a 90 degree clip and allows you to install cables in two different directions onto the module frame. Straight on and in a 90 degree orientation, which gives you some flexibility on how you would like to route your wires. This clip also holds two PV wires. Now we're going to talk about the ACC RBC 15. This clip fits into any rail channel up to 13 and a half millimeters. The way you use it is you take your wires, put the RBC over top, and then secure it into your rail channel, like so. Now let's talk about the WBS line. This is a WBS 8V, eight stands for the length. <clears throat> so this is eight inches long. We go all the way up to 36 inches and we can do custom sizes. <clears throat> this is made out of stainless steel with a PVC coating on the outside of the wire. The cool thing about this is it has a retention feature that acts as a third hand. So you can string up all your wires and then this retains it until you're ready to crimp. So I'm gonna show you how to install. <clears throat> the WBS can go around rails through a module hole or a purlin hole. So you wrap it around your rail and then you slide the wire through the thrill. Like so. Ta -da. Now we're going to talk about our line of insulated steel PV clips. <clears throat> I'll show you how they're installed. Put your wires in, put them over your bolt. They can be installed into a rail channel via any sort of bolt that you're going to be using or through a module hole or a purlin hole. <clears throat> they come in sizes up to uh, one and a half inches for bundle diameter, and the lowest one we go is four inch. Now we're gonna talk about our Wiley insulated strap. This is it, it's reusable. Uh, it goes around a rail through a module hole or a purlin hole. So all you do is you, like a regular cable tie, put it around your rail, Put your wires through, secure it, and then you're just going to bend this tab back 
and there you go. Uh, they come in lengths between 8 inches and 12, and the bundle diameters are 2 to 3 inches. Now we're going to talk about our ACC R2E. This is a rail clip, and these are rail clips as well. So what these do is they go into a rail channel. Here's a rail channel, and it just pops over the lip of the rail channel. This one holds uh, micro inverter cables and also larger diameter PV. The ACC R4 holds up to four PV cables, and the R2 holds micro inverter cables and PV cables. As you can see, there are various ways cables can be managed to prevent accidents and prolong the life of the modules. As always, thank you for joining us today. Join us next time as we tackle integrated bonding. I'm Sarah, and visit Bernie.com for all your solar product needs. Until next time.